the uh, Switch 2960, a simulator program uh, called Packet Tracer from Cisco. And uh, it simulates, uh, what it does is simulates uh, a switch and uh, various um, parts like uh, routers, PCs, and all the things you need to use uh, to simulate a network. So, in this case, I'm using a switch. Um, to demonstrate how the, the, the first initial uh, configuration to use it. You can see here, you can see the switch there, 29.6 series. Let's go to CLI mode where we can make the change on iOS. So as soon as you boot up, it shows all the information, it simulates, em emulates uh, the software of a real one so you can see the software version the model all the details of it right let's get it started um, so uh, in the real world you will be connecting uh, a PC you can see here PC as well I can make all the changes IP that you up and blah 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 and then you uh, you probably be connecting via console cable IS232 to your console cable there you can see this symbolizes the console cable connected to the switch so in a real world you, that's how you're gonna make any changes on, uh, on the switch the PC and then a console cable connected to the switch via this switch console cable port in this case here in this figure you, we can't see the, the console which is at the back of, of the, the, the switch if you're using windows xp you're going to use a hyper terminal and if you use uh, vista or windows 7 you're probably going to use another um, terminal emulator application the prompt you know, the user exec you can't see much if you use that like let's say show so you can see there how much on the basic information of of the uh, switch which is to enter you just uh, you just type enable or you could type uh, en as well which is the abbreviation you could type as well i don't know en en and then tab and then it fills up the space as well so there's different ways of of getting inside if there was a password probably going to be asked for a password right now uh, which i'll be showing in a few seconds i mean a few minutes as you can see there this symbol here indicates you were in privilege mode so remember doing the show i showed before i can see more stuff see more details there more things more details of things you can do um, so like I have, I've already showed if you type exit you can you know get out from it or you could you know type disable as well you can get out, out of it so this is the basic first things first if switch. you have an, a switch or a router and if you want to uh, connect by a console cable physically um, to g gain, gain access using Windows Vista or Windows 7 you need a terminal emulator uh, which it doesn't come with uh, Vista and Windows 7 just the Windows XP uh, but there are some softwares you can download from the internet you see here UTY is a free telnet slash SSH client by a uh, chiarch.greenend.org.uk Just have a look at it and uh, download if you were struggling to make it work in your uh, PC. Here on the, on the simulator program you can, you can either connect from the PC you know via the the terminal emulator 
with the basic configurations you you know you got to do it and then you can you can connect it that way you can see we are in the same switch or you can connect straight from the switch there when you click it if you use in Cisco uh, packet tracer which uh, the only way to get it as you probably already know it's uh, to be affiliated at Network Academy or through professional but there are some other free simulator software where you can uh, emulate the software from this switch and the, the router so this is just to show you how uh, you basically connect uh, you know your PC on um, on a switch and make any configuration but in this case I'll be using mostly just the switch itself because it's quicker and then we are in the prompt on on the CLI mode iOS or personal system of the switch or, or a router so, um, to be able to make any changes uh, put an IP address on a port or to make any major changes on a switch or a router you need to be on the configuration uh, mode uh, to do that you, know, you just get into the privilege mode and then you type configure terminal you see things change there so that bit there uh, prompt prompt there signifies that the switch is in a in a global configuration mode so you can make major changes on it so let's fix it again so you could just type conf 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 t and then you gain as well okay while you in the in the global mode configuration um, if you want to make any changes on the interface let's say on i don't know on an interface interface port number one there you uh, just have to type interface fast ethernet zero slash one and it will you are inside of the interface interface right now and then you can make any configurations mod okay let's revise it summarize summarizes is uh, so as your switch as your user privilege mode conf t then you get to the global mode and then if you want to gain to the interface or you know into a port to make any any changes that's it you can just exit and there you go